something that you referred to in your opening statement. Uh, Georgia farmers faced a big crisis when immigration reform was passed at the state level. What could be done and what should be done to make sure that our region's farmers can continue to prosper when it comes to finding employable workers? Um, I think that the migrant workers are a, a decent solution if we can come up with some way. I, I don't think that just because someone crosses the border into the U.S. that they should be, you know, granted citizenship and free reign, but I think there needs to be some kind of middle ground where we can say, okay, you're doing something for us, so we can do something for you. There needs to be a some give and take, I think. It's not just a, you know, close the doors and say, go away, we'll try and figure it out, because it's not working. Thank you very much. Uh, finally, our last question for you. Why are you the best candidate to serve the citizens of District 174? Which, by the way, I will tell you very quickly, is a huge district. It's in Kings and Lowndes County. It goes all the way to Camden County with a new redrawn district. So it is, encompasses quite a large area. So why would you be the best uh, candidate to serve those citizens? I think that I'm the best candidate because I can relate to people. I'm a regular person. I'm one of everyone else. I, I go to school here. I work here. I have the everyday struggles that everyone has. And I think that... That's what we need is someone who's just like you to go up there and say, this is what we need. It's not someone fighting for you, it's someone fighting with you. I mean, these things that we need change on here are things that I need change for my family. So it's not, you're hoping that someone's gonna go up there and make things better for you. I'm fighting because I need those things as well. Thank you. Yeah.